A black Superman is not exactly a new idea. I mean, you should have just seen the uh, cover for Superman Man of Steel number 26. And um, that's John Henry Irons' Steel. Now, when Superman died in comics back in the 90s, and Superman number 75, there were four replacements for him a while before the, the one true Superman returned, as it were, the one true Man of Steel returned. And they were the Eradicator, which I thought was the real Superman, but um, you had to guess who, who, which one it was. It was not, none of them. But there was also the Cyborg and the Superboy and the John Henry Irons fella. And apparently one of them was going to be the real Superman. That was just a bit of a thing that they had for a bit. But um, John Henry Irons, well, he's, he's a black guy, isn't he? And um, as you can see in that cover, that cover has actually gone with the S, the Superman logo on the front and the, the, on his cape as well. In Superman, Man of Steel 25 and 24, it's John Henry Irons' uh, 24, 23, 22, 21, and uh, I think 21 as well. It goes from Funeral for a Friend into the Reign of a Superman. And for a number of issues of Reign of a Superman in Man of Steel, there's four Superman comics of the time. Adventures of Superman, Superman, Action Comics for Superman, and Superman the Man of Steel. And John Henry Irons is starring in the Man of Steel one, because he's Steel, so he's got the St Man of Steel comic. But um, he's appearing throughout all the Reign of a Superman storyline, and then he went off into his own solo title as Steel anyway. And they made a movie with Shaquille O'Neal to boot. It's called Steel. So, you know, a black Superman is not exactly a new ID. Technically, they haven't quite called him Clark Kent yet. You know, Superman as Clark Kent as black. They've had, what is it? Uh, Calvin Ellis and Val Zod, or whatever it is, you know, and as the closest they've got to the... Um, Calvin Ellis, I suppose, as closest I've got. But now they're, they're thinking about the one with, with Clark Kent. But in all honesty, it's not exactly a new concept. It's a little bit closer to making a Superman a black guy, I suppose, but um, they've already done it. They did it years ago. So people, some people are making a little bit of a fuss. Most people don't really care. Some people are making a little bit of a fuss, but really, it's a storm in a key, teacup as far as I'm concerned.